husband of Cheyenne Floyd sentenced to jail time on DUI charges. Hello, my name is Eve, welcome back to my VTM YouTube channel. There's more bad news for Zach Davis and Cheyenne Floyd this week. As we previously reported, Davis has had some brushes with the law in the past, but he appeared to have turned over a new leaf. Just last month, Zach and Cheyenne got married in a lavish ceremony attended by several of the couple's Teen Mom co-stars. And now, it looks like Zach will be spending a good chunk of his first year of marriage behind bars. According to a new report from the Ashley's Reality Roundup, Zach has been sentenced to four months in jail on a charge of driving with a blood alcohol content BAC, of 0.08% or more. According to court documents obtained by the Ashley, Davis was also charged with driving on a license that was suspended slash revoked due to previous DUI, and knowingly driving on a suspended slash revoked license. But all of those charges were dismissed after Zach pled not guilty back on October 4. Davis was only prosecuted for the, the DUI, but that was enough to land him behind bars. At a hearing held this week, Zach was sentenced to 120 days in the Los Angeles County Jail. He was also received 60 months of probation, and he'll be required to pay a $500 fine. Davis will also be required to report for four days of community labor and participate in an 18-month licensed alcohol education and counseling program. Please like and subscribe to my channel and to click on the bell icon to get new video updates. According to the Ashley, Zach is scheduled to report to the LA County Jail on November 1st. That means, of course, that he's likely to spend the entire holiday season behind bars, which is a pretty big bummer for his new wife. Zach has a long history of legal trouble, dating back to his earliest brushes with the law back in 2015. In 2018, he arrested for grand larceny, but the charges were eventually dropped. He was arrested for grand larceny a second time in 2019 and sentenced to three years of probation and 32 days in LA County Jail for his crimes. In January of 2022, Davis was arrested at the airport after returning from a trip to Mexico with his family. He was charged with a parole violation stemming from a DUI arrest, not the same DUI arrest that he was sentenced for this week. Needless to say, Zach seems to have had some serious trouble staying on the right side of the law. Davis says he spent most of the past year working on starting his own business, and marriage might be the beginning of a fresh start for the 31-year-old. But before he can fully leave the past behind him, it looks like he'll have to pay the piper for his past misdeeds.